Sunday morning. I'm out uh, riding around my neighborhood. I had a little fire last night. Had my mom at the house. Uh, was reading on. I don't know if you guys have a next door. Yeah. Damn it. This road sucks. Welcome to South Carolina. All the roads suck. Uh, there's an app called Next Door that allows you to talk with the people in your neighborhood or post and it's just a bunch of whiny fuckers somebody was complaining about some kids on a golf cart anyway uh, somebody whose lawnmower blade I sharpened once upon a time in the past wait what is that that's a fucking score score I'm gonna throw that shit in the back hold up there. sorry about that a couple of beach cruisers. Yeah, lighting won't show it at the moment. Get into the shade and you can see there's beach cruisers in the back. Anyway, somebody whose uh, lawnmower blade that I sharpened once upon a time sent me a message on uh, next door. Uh, they laughed at my who gives a shit that the kids are riding around on a golf cart and because people just bitch and complain about absolutely nothing. Anyway, just scored two bicycles off the side of the road on a Sunday morning. One of them's a Schwinn. I'm a sucker for a Schwinn. If you didn't see it, I rode a Schwinn. Uh, 450 miles from Charleston, South Carolina, all the way up the Outer Banks of North Carolina. I did that. None of you fuckers watched it, though. And the four of you who are watching this video who actually watched me do that will comment, well, well I get it. Some of you watched it. Ugh. The majority of you did not watch that. Anyway, I'm riding around my neighborhood on a Sunday morning looking for junk. Somebody wanted me to come sharpen their lawnmower blade, and they didn't have it off yet. Wow, look at that. So at first glance, I see this old Mercedes. Come on, really? I have dust on my window so it won't focus on the Mercedes. There it is. But upon further inspection, you look behind the Mercedes. Look at that little nugget. Look at that little nugget sitting back there. I don't know what that is other than it's cool as shit. I'm gonna have to come have a conversation with this guy. Anyway, it's a neat little car. Some sort of a, uh, I, I've seen the guy driving it once, I've never seen it sitting out in the yard. Some sort of a uh, little right-hand drive uh, Japanese little micro car. Anywho, I'm gonna ride around the neighborhood today and see if I can find anything good other than the, uh, the two beach cruisers I've already got in the back. Those people got their driveway paved. Uh, nothing like a Sunday morning for uh, junk picking in my neighborhood. Uh, not a whole lot going on at the boat landing. I see a lady trying to hold a boat from floating away. And a lady with a baby. I came down here to see if Ricky was down here. Apparently all that police commotion the other night, uh, he didn't get arrested or go to the hospital. So I don't know exactly what happened. I haven't talked to him yet. But there's a dude with a little dog. Dude with a little dog. Perhaps for the moment, I just uh, give you guys the uh, shaky ass scenic tour of my neighborhood. That's honestly, this is the quality of the roads in South Carolina. They shake a little bit. Uh, let's see, here's Ricky's old lady's house. Let's see if his bike is in the driveway. It is not. Which means that he is at Ernie's house. And that's never a good sign. Range Rover owner hiding behind their car. Hi. I'm sorry. You drive a Range Rover? Fuck you too. And yes, in my neighborhood, there are still some dirt roads. neighborhood is awesome. Just don't particularly care for 
about half of the people who live in it. Well, that lady's got her stable doors open. There's a lady who lives where we just drove by there who uh, has a little pony, or did have a little pony, I don't know. But there's a handful of uh, miniature horses and miniature ponies in this neighborhood. Uh, one of them died recently, and I don't know which one it is. It is not Annabelle, which is the one that lives uh, down my side street. It's one of the others. I'm not sure if it's the one where we just drove by or not. But, yeah. I mean, if you're going to go side of the road trash picking, man, this is the way to do it. This is the best neighborhood ever. And there's so many wasteful people who just throw things away here, hence my shed. 95% uh, of the shit for my shed came out of the garbage in this neighborhood off the side of the road and see if I needed an entertainment center or if I were to sell at the flea market I could pick up that but I have no have no need for that you can't fit a flat screen in it and I don't sell at the flea market all right so I'm about to roll up on a pile of stuff here I can't see anything other than chairs given the light need any of that stuff at all so it's been so damn hot lately I suspect that nobody's really been outside cleaning like the month of August in South Carolina is absolutely fucking terrible man it's been between like 93 and 97 degrees every day hey look there's a branch that's gonna hang down and hit your car now it's been stupid hot stupid hot uh, every day for a uh, long time now hence ain't nobody outside throwing nothing away cleaning nothing out there ain't really a whole lot to find so I guess those bikes are a uh, win for the moment because I'm not looking for bags of leaves uh, some elephant ears but I'm going to continue to uh, ride around for the moment, and I'll get back to the house and show you guys the bikes. Uh, a couple of plastic sawhorses I don't need. Hey, look, there's a dog taking a leak on a bag. Uh, 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 some broken lawn chairs I don't need. Not like a lot of guys that literally take anything out of the trash. If this fucking guy would just pay attention for a half of a fucking second. I think that guy works at the grocery store. He's got a lot of hair. And again, I've got a lot of hair anymore, too. Can't judge the man for having hair. Nope. Alright, so for the moment, I think that's going to be about it. I'm, uh gonna make a right turn up here and headed back toward the house and uh, see what the wife's doing. I made her a, uh, uh, hold on, I think I might need to fart. <sighs> made her a uh, monstrosity of a uh, breakfast burrito this morning. And see, I've got a shit like this, man. Leave a damn lawnmower on the side of the road at the sidewalk. At this time of the day, on a Sunday, Somebody's going to pick that guy's lawnmower up, and then that guy's going to complain that somebody stole it. And arguably somebody did steal it, but if you leave it curbside on a Sunday morning, people are going to take it. And oftentimes I'll go knock on somebody's door. Like, I, I knocked on somebody's door earlier. They had a little garden cart and a bunch of stuff that was out, literally, where you would put your trash. And, uh... It wasn't out there for trash, and it had been out there since yesterday, and be like, you need to move that shit. Don't leave that there. Because the next guy that comes by looking for junk isn't going to be me. The next guy who comes by looking for junk is just going to throw that shit in the back of his truck and drive away, and then you're going to be without it. And then you're going to complain that somebody stole it, like with the lawnmower. And arguably somebody stole it, but you put it where you put large trash pickup, and I don't know that that would hold up in court, to be quite honest with you. Because, uh, I mean, once you put it on the sidewalk, it's trash. It's property of the city. The city doesn't give a shit if you dig in the trash. But they didn't put it there for trash. But, yeah, a lot of times that gets mistaken. Drive around a big bump. Come to South Carolina, we got the worst roads ever. 
Ow. Still dealing with this broken rib. It is tenfold better today than it was yesterday or the day before. But still things like coughing, sneezing, uh, burping. <coughs> painful 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 made it back to the house see there's a motive custom cruiser uh, and then there's this thing that's a Schwinn I mean still tires are flat but look at that thing it's laying on the side of the road a little bit of WD-40 man that thing would be good as new anyway that's it for now Maybe I'll do some more later, but I think I'm going to just put this video up how it is. Pepperoni dog farts. Fuckers.